Yo yeah, everyone, my name is Samus and welcome back to The Walking Dead, the final season, episode 3 uh, Jadi belakang-belakang ini gue lagi kurang fit Makanya dari kemarin gue uh, belum bikin video dan baru sekarang baru sempat bikin Dan gue gak pakai sem dulu karena ya muka gue lagi unfit banget buat di kamera Jadi gue pakai suara gue aja Ya, tadi gue gak mau record sih, tapi di show must go on kan, jadi gue harus record aja dulu Walaupun gue gak pakai face cam, tapi setidaknya gue ada, ada suara gue lah ya Jadi, ya lah, langsung aja lah ke episode 3 Dan mungkin nanti uh, gue juga gak banyak ngomong ya Jadi mungkin sama mungkin tanpa komentar atau gue ngomongnya dikit aja gitu Jadi gue juga menghemat tenaga ini Biar gak capek-capek banget nanti nah, akhirnya So here he, here he is. I've never met anyone like James before. I mean, he's tough. Not like you, though. He doesn't kill monsters, but he's not scared of them either. He's cool. Hey, Clem. Willie told me the plan. How'd things go with that guy? James. He agreed to help us. If somebody told me we were gonna sneak onto a boat and a herd of walkers, I'd call them crazy. What are you doing with those? Oh, well, I wanted to throw one last hoot nanny before the big fight. Swear? Huh? It sounds like a swear. Uh. <laughs> what the hell is a hoot nanny? <laughs> It's just another way of saying party. Oh, I know okay. it sounds strange, throwing a party, but people need something to lift their spirits right about now. This could be her last chance. Mm. I want to make some tea for everyone. Could I borrow your little heater thing? What can I do? We need to pretty up the old music room. Could you make us something colorful to hang up? <laughs> okay, I'll be an artist. I'm gonna make the deck, uh, the decor, decoration, a decoration for the party. Okay, I'll get the heater. Okay, udah gerakin. Oh, nih heaternya. Okay. Okay. Langsung aja lah. Make sure. I'm done, Clem. Come see. Okay, be right there. Hey, you're getting better at this. Soon you'll be as good an artist as Ten. I don't know. He's really good. Something wrong? AJ? I was just thinking about stuff while I was drawing. There are three kind of eyes, Clem. Hmm. Oh, yeah? There are live people eyes. We got those. Then there's monsters' eyes. They usually look like dirty water. Other times, monsters' eyes aren't even wet. And then there are live people eyes right as you kill them. Like you did to Abel. His, his eyes look like you blew a candle out. He was a bad guy. I know I shouldn't feel like this. I hated him too. I think there's something wrong with me. You know what, AJ? Everything <coughs> you're feeling is okay. It makes you a good person. Am I good? I wish what we did felt good. Yes, you are. Part of me wants to like it. I'm getting real smart. Mm -mm. <laughs> Is that right? Yes. Because I'm always thinking all the time. Okay. What are you thinking about right now? You getting bit, turning into a monster. Oh no, yeah. Mm. Yeah. The older I get, the more I see it. I don't know why. What happens then? Anyone can get bit. Doesn't matter if you're inside or. Outside or how careful you are. 
AJ, we've talked about this a lot. If I get bit, you know what has to happen. I don't want to talk about this anymore. But you brought it up, so we're going to. It does something weird to my stomach. Like I'm gonna get the dookies. <laughs> AJ, I need to know you remember what we talked about. What you're supposed to do if it happens. Listen to me. If I get bit, you'll... Just shoot me. Shoot. No. No, I'm not gonna do that. AJ, you promised. I don't care. I'm not gonna shoot you. Yeah, sure, if you get bit, shoot me, AJ. I want Come you to on. bite me too. What? No. What? You don't mean that. I don't wanna be alone. Come on. Please don't be mad. I can't live with you not with me, Clem. I know we've talked about it <clears throat> so much, but don't make me. Alvin Jr., you know you're not supposed to talk like this. You're too strong and too brave. I don't think I am anymore about this. Yes, you are. You are, okay? <sighs> You can't break promises, AJ. I know. That's true. You're not letting this go, are you? James said... <sighs> Guess not. That we could be around when we're monsters. Like on the inside. If you got bit, and then bit me, then maybe we'd still be together. It would just be a different together. Hmm. We might even be okay. You think so? Please don't, AJ. AJ, I'm done. We're not doing this anymore. You're gonna drop it, or you're in big trouble. I mean it. Why can't you just be nice to me, stupid Ed? AJ. Oh. What's up with AJ? Little guy ran out of here like he was on fire. <sighs> he just needs some space. Uh-huh. What do you want to do? Okay, that's fine. I was wondering. Well, I can't help but thinking. <sighs> you shot that raider who grabbed me, but you saw them take Violet too. Which means you could have saved Violet and not me. Why? Why would you pick me? <sighs> I mean. I wouldn't have picked me. Hell, I don't know anyone who would have picked me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I couldn't let them take you. You're too important to me. <laughs> yeah. I know I'm always teasing her, trying to get her to do that one eye roll she does. You know the one, where it's like, you're such a dumbass, she has to do a full body eye roll. I do it because when I actually do manage to make her laugh, it's worth it. If I needed her, she'd be there. Meet Cleaver in hand, ready to chop someone in half if it meant protecting me. Hey, we're going to get them back, Louis. Yeah, damn right we will. Actually, um, that's... <laughs> That's not the only reason I dropped by. Ruby's whole party idea kind of made me realize something. What's that? What are you doing? Well, I figured since we might die tomorrow and never get to go on a real date. Oh. Okay. I thought we could. Damn it. Okay, Louis, we played your way. Have one now. I promise I'll keep it short so we can finish getting things ready for tomorrow. <laughs> but I mean, nothing's wrong with short and sweet, right? Wait, that's not... Yeah. I forget I said that. Let's do it. I never thought I'd get to go on a date, ever. Really? Never? Have you met you? End of the world or not, someone would have at least tried to sweep you off your feet. <laughs> all right, all right. What? 
is true. What do you know about dating, anyway? I'll have you know, I found some magazines in the headmaster's office that had some very interesting things to say about the dating world. Ooh. Oh, yeah? Like what? Well, like, it said you can tell a lot about someone based on what they look for in a partner. You know, brains, brawn, dashing good looks, great sense of humor. Oh, jadi kenapa si Luis tu ngelawak mulu? Sure, I guess. Huh. <laughs> okay. What, uh, what would you say your thing is? That you look for in a guy? If you had to pick. Kalau cewek tuh biasanya suka sama orang yang humoris. Hmm, I think I prefer a good <laughs> sense of humor. <laughs> All right, I see you. You got me this time. <sighs> If only I knew someone with one of those. Mm -hmm. I think that deserves a toast. A toast? Don't those usually come at the end? Hey, I warned you I'd make this quick. So, what do you say? To our last night alive. To our last night alive. Now that's the spirit. No, I have to admit I didn't expect it to be so disheartening to hear you say it. So, I'll see you over there. Hey, Clem. Oh. <laughs> wow, where did you find a beach ball? It was in some garbage behind one of the dorms. I had to blow it up and, and that was pretty gross, but look, it works. Oh, <laughs> did you? I should start heading back to the admin building. Uh. Okay, you kan tadi bete ya. Sekarang lu ngajak main. Hmm. I thought you were mad at me. Huh? Well, I am, but I still wanted to show you. <laughs> okay. It's cool, right? Super cool. <laughs> Back. Tadi dia nimpuk pala gua ya. Ku timpuk lagi palanya balik. Kurin. Mamam lu. Give it a hug, AJ. Nice. I love you, Clem. And I'm sorry for calling you a dumbhead. It was stupid head. You called me a stupid head. Oh, <laughs> right. I love you back, kiddo. <sighs> okay, we better get ready to go. Sounds like they need us in the music room. Okay. Sekarang kita bakal uh, jalan ke partinya RC Ruby yang udah disiapin nama Doi. Jadi jadi kayak malam-malam tenang gitu loh sebelum ya penyerangan ekstrim dimulai biasa lah. Relax Baru. We still need to figure out lighting, music, and something to write on that banner. If we're gonna die, we should have some fun first. Music. You gonna play the piano all night? Wouldn't be a party without some kind of mood lighting. I've been going back and forth between colors hmm. for ages. Green's calming, but purple might be nice. Rim gets natural moonlight, so something purple to compliment that, maybe? Hmm. Well, purple was my dad's favorite color. I read somewhere purple was a color of royalty. Yeah. That describes us exactly not at all. I'll make it happen. Look, check this out. When you turn that crank there, it plays music. Any kind you want. But how? Well, that... I don't really know, but showing's better than telling. Are we using the banner for some kind of party theme? Hmm, not exactly. It's meant to be more motivational. I'd keep it short, though. There's not as much room as you think. Okay, go so I was yeah, something yeah. Yeah. Hey, Jay, like, pick something? We're gonna get through okay. this. Pick something? Just... Trying to instill yeah. some confidence, you know? AJ, why don't you come up with something? Really? I have an idea. 
It'll be a surprise. I promise not to swear all over it. Okay, we'll have Ten break out his paintbrush and ride it out. Okay, uh, how about the music, huh? Pulled out the old headmaster's gramophone <coughs> so he could play <coughs> some records. Uh. Not much of a selection, but it should do. Okay, Just tell me what you want to listen to. Country sabi si. Um, maybe something country? That's my favorite. We are all very surprised. This place is gonna look great. It is going to be great, Ruby. Oh, and Willie was asking for you. He's up in Marlin's office. He said he had a surprise for the party, but he wanted to show it to you first. Apa tu? Lepas aja bingung dia, agak tahu vinyl vinyl. Hey Clem, check it out. I found a bunch of books on ships. There's some awesome stuff about fires at sea and explosions and stuff. The key is the boiler. Wait, what are you talking about? I have an idea about how to stop those assholes coming back to the school after we've rescued the others. And from hurting anyone else ever again. Hmm. We're gonna blow up the boat. It's the only way to make nice. sure they don't come back. Besides, it feels right, you know? For Mitch. Nice. Mitch would love this plan. I know, it's perfect. I can't think of a better memorial than to blow that boat out of the water. The tricky bit is timing the explosion so that it happens after you get off the boat. Mm, yeah, do. Trust me, this will work. We'll be okay. Okay, everybody, get ready hey. for the Hey, it's country music. And, um, Clem, I'm sorry for before, about how I treated Ten. I didn't mean to get so angry. I know it's not his fault. That's nice, Willie, but don't tell me. Tell Ten. Yeah, lu ngomong aja langsung ke Ten. Jangan ngomong ke gua ya. Thanks for noticing me. <laughs> oh man, it is getting some moves, buddy. Ew. Hey, this anjing. Hey, anjing. Wow, this looks great, Ruby. <coughs> Couldn't have done it without you. But just wait till you see what else I've got planned. Go ahead and mingle. I'll let you know when it's time. I guess I'll mingle. Mingle. I see you two are working together. Yeah, Willie asked me to help with his special project. Well, that's good to hear. Is it ready? Good to go, Clem. It'll work. Actually, ah, uh, I was thinking maybe we should name it something cool. I mean, well, uh, I think it deserves a name. All the best bombs have names. Yeah. Yeah, we absolutely have to name it. I thought you'd make fun of me, but hell yeah, let's name this fucker. <laughs> let's name this fucker. Willie Junior, no Ruby's Revenge. Mitch's masterpiece. How about Mitch's masterpiece? Yeah, I like that. Mitch would have too. Okay, then it's settled. Hey, hey, you still got some <laughs> school I found them. Okay, Clementine, <coughs> these <coughs> here <coughs> are our official <laughs> Erickson psych evaluations and probationary reports. Okay, I don't get it. Well, these explain why all of us got sent to this school in the first place. And how we got stuck here for as long as we did. So, what's the game? I figured if we're all going on this crazy mission together, we might as well know who we really are. So, I'll read some of what the adults thought about us. And you have to guess which one of us fits the bill. I'll make sure it's someone you've actually met. This will be the first one. While otherwise a remarkable student, blank, 
continues to be plagued by fits of anger, uncontrollable cursing, and repeated physical altercations with the senior faculty. Hmm. Yang suka marah-marah. Marlon, nah, Marlon suka marah-marah. Luis, Luis mah periang aja. As all of you know, Ruby. Ruby ini kan suka marah-marah ya. Awal-awal aja gue dikatain motherfucker aja. You know what, Ruby? I bet you're reading your own file. <laughs> wow! How'd you guess that? <laughs> It's the red hair. Dead giveaway. <laughs> I mean, I can totally see it. The first time I met Ruby, she was all... Tuh. That little motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I said I was sorry. Our sweet Ruby here was kind of a nightmare when she first showed up. Ooh. She once chased the home ec teacher around the yard with a barbecue fork this big. Oh, no way. Crap. <laughs> Don't worry. That was a long time ago. Sekarang udah tobat ya, Bie. He got to know why I got to here. Dude, no. Chronic masturbation. <laughs> Willie, I speak to all of us when I say nobody has ever. I just ever wait, wanted to know that. Wait, 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 wait. Dia dikirim ke sekolahnya gara-gara dia kronis sama coli. Siap. <laughs> aduh, ketawa aduh. Ayo. Uh, don't you dare. <coughs> eh. <coughs> Jangan kasih tahu. Ten, astagfirullahalazim, Ten. Dikasih tahu dong. Uh, anyway, maybe we should change up the music. Aduh. Oh, like all kind of different music. Gua jam itu titiknya kecil tuh. There's a lot of them. How many? I don't know. Uh, uh, a lot. Okay, put it. Sure, we've heard enough of this. Break out the jazz. Hey, this reminds me of Fallout. I didn't realize how many of us we lost. Remember that Justin guy? And Theresa and Jasper. That one girl with colored braces, and Joey, Maddie, Lamar, Aaron. She had the braces. Alex, Dewey, Trey, Stephanie. Holy crap! How many of us died? Thirty-four. Man, banyak banget yang udah meninggal katanya di sekolah. Ada tiga puluh empat. Whose is it? Violet's. Should we read it? I, uh, I, I could tell you guys my story instead. What got me sent here, I mean. Only if you want. It's not great. Hmm. Gue sih penasaran. Jadi gue pilih eh only if you want to share it with me. I was hoping you'd tell me. So my family was stupid rich. Parents gave me everything I wanted when I wanted it. Except for one thing. Spoiled rich kid. Singing lessons. God. I begged my dad, told him I wanted to be a real musician. But all he said was you get to be happy or you get to be rich. Can't be both. I know now that he was just trying to teach me a dumb dad lesson, but I hated him. Kalau nggak bisa kaya sambil senang, lo harus milih antara senang atau lo jadi kaya. So I teach him a lesson. Oh, I thought I'll break up my parents' marriage. That hurt real bad, right? So that's a. I broke into my dad's credit card accounts and made all these purchases in his name. Did this for over a year. This is how rich we were. He never noticed he was spending a fortune on a mistress that I'd made up for him. Ah. But I made sure my mom did. Sent her all the receipts for the hotel rooms, the jewelry, all of it. They had a fight all night long. He denied it. She wouldn't have it. I sat in the corner and cried to help it feel more real. They just made a bad mistake. When their divorce was final, I told them the truth. I said, "You get to be happy or you get to be rich. You don't get to be both." 
You know? Those two would have been happily married forever, but... Then I had to go be a vindictive fuckhead. I came here the week after. I can see by your face you regret it. They said we were bad people, Glem. They weren't wrong. Still, none of us deserve to be ditched out here in the middle of the forest by the people that were supposed to make us better. Sorry, this was supposed to be fun. I guess I'm not really a game person. Yeah, how does this game? Don't beat yourself game. up. Well, you said it yourself. Uh, Clem needs to know who she's leading into battle. Hey, I've got an idea. Do you guys remember when? Many would sing us Don't Be Afraid when all of us used to get scared. Of course I remember. I helped compose it with her. Could you maybe play it for us? If I was here, she could sing the words, but... Yeah. Yeah, I'd love to, Ten. Masih ada tuh, CL. This is for you, Minnie. Cir enak banget lagunya ya, sangat menenangkan hati. <tuh> Oke ini udah setengah jam gue record dan gue udah nggak kuat. <tuh> Mending kayaknya gue akhiri dulu aja sampai di sini. What? Uh. I know, I know, part kalinya agak sedikit memesankan karena gue juga nggak ada energinya. Gue ngomong nggak terlalu semangat seperti biasanya dan nggak ada facecam juga. Kalian nggak bisa lihat muka lu juga, oke nggak apa-apa. <laughs> oke, okay, tapi gue janji next part um, mungkin gue udah lebih fit, gue akan nyari naik facecamnya lagi dan semoga energi gue udah bisa balik lagi seperti semula, oke? Okay? Jadi mohon maaf untuk kepart kali ini, gue hanya bisa kasih segini dulu aja. Oke, okay, kalau suka sama videonya silahkan like dan subscribe. Kalau ada yang ingin disampaikan, just let me know di comment section down below. 
But thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.